Hey everybody, welcome to my latest video, which is a full garden reset. Our garden was looking worse for wear, so we thought we would spend the morning out here getting it lovely and clean and tidy, especially as it was my son's birthday and he had some garden toys for his birthday. So we worked hard and it looked pretty good when we were finished. However, the first thing in the morning, it was freezing cold and so windy. So the first thing I did was put on my giant puffer coat. I got the hose out ready for Clint to set up the jet washer. While he was getting that ready, I started de-weeding. So many weeds have grown over the winter in this back planter that we have in the garden. We are growing black bamboo in this planter, which will cover the entire fence eventually. So it's really important that I pull out all of the weeds so that there is room for the bamboo to spread. This one was absolutely gigantic and so spiky. Oh, ah! <laughs> this one's sharp. Oh my God. <laughs> Once we were done de-weeding, it was time to just sort of generally tidy up. There was just stuff everywhere, toys and just mess. This huge golf net that I finally convinced him to get rid of because it's falling apart. And yeah, just general, just sort of stuff all over the floor that the boys have just been dropping. Also, Cooper's beloved activity table that his dad made for him a couple of summers ago needs to go. It has gone a bit rotten and a bit gross and it's time to say goodbye to it, unfortunately. I made sure that there was nothing left on the lawn whatsoever so that it was a completely blank canvas for me to be able to do the next thing, which you will see in just a second. Guys, if it doesn't look like I've lost my mind already riding my son's little motorbike off the lawn, you really are gonna think I've lost my mind now. I am vacuuming the grass. Now, before you say what on earth are you doing, our grass is artificial, it is plastic, so it's perfectly safe to be vacuuming it. And actually it really does need to be done once a year before summer hits like this. It is covered in these little leaves that have fallen off the bamboo and it just looks a mess. And the only way to really thoroughly get rid of it all is to vacuum it. I'm using Prince Industrial Henry Vacuum because it really does the job. And while I was vacuuming the grass, which by the way took so long, Clint was down on the patio using the jet washer to try and get it as clean as possible. We are going to get it professionally cleaned, um, hopefully in the next few weeks, but for now this will do and got rid of the majority of dirt and marks. What the neighbours must have thought of me out here vacuuming the lawn, I have no idea. I have finished a lawn, so I'm going to set up my son's new slide, which is one of the things he got for his birthday. Luckily, it was super easy to build. I just clipped everything together and set it up ready for him on the lawn. Before Clint puts the jet washer away, he's just going to work on the decking and on the hot tub cover, which has this awful red mark on it. We were not sure what this was, but luckily the jet washer got it off really easily. So my son's big birthday present was this lovely Smoby garden playhouse, which by the way took like three hours to build the night before. But we were just deciding where to put it and setting it up so that it's all ready for him when he gets home from nursery this afternoon. Then it was time to put all of the furniture back on the patio. We decided not to put the cushions on the furniture just yet, as we still have quite a bit of rain ahead of us before summer officially hits. 
which means unfortunately it's not quite hot tub weather yet. It looks so tempting when I lifted it up to check it, but it's bubbling away, just waiting for some warmer weather. But here you go guys, about three hours later and the garden was looking so much neater and tidier and cleaner with all of my son's new bits and bobs ready for him to play with when he gets home later this afternoon. Penny was obviously very impressed with our efforts also, and here you can see my little one Hello. was very Hello. happy with everything when he got home what and ran making? straight out there to play. Hello. But guys, thank you so much for watching my latest making? video. I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to subscribe for two videos a week, oh. and I will see you in my next one. Some grapes. Oh.